In this video, I'm going to show you how I made 70,000 Canadian dollars in August. Right now, it is September 6th, so the August books are done and we can now analyze them. So as most of you guys know, I live in Canada. 70,000 Canadian dollars is just over 50,000 US dollars. So you can do the conversion and see exactly how much that is in whatever currency you want. Now first, let's break this down by source. There's basically only two main sources of my income, my agency income, North Digital, and then my coaching income from my YouTube channel under my name, Sean Wiggins. So most of the revenue in August came from my agency, which is about 55,000 Canadian, and the remaining 15,000 came from some form of coaching. Now let's break it down again by payment processor. I feel like this makes it more tangible for people watching. So we have Stripe. This is where I get most of my credit card payments from my agency. I'm in my Stripe account. I will select last month here. So we have August 1st to August 31st. Hit enter. So we have 40,000. Let's just call it 40,000. Now the next payment processor is Payoneer. One of our Rev Share clients pays us exclusively through Payoneer. This is the Payoneer statement. So this is in US dollars. We have 4,000 US dollars on August 1st, 4,000 US dollars on August 15th, and then 1,500 US dollars on the 25th. And then you can see here also, I've taken some money out to my bank accounts. So in total, that's 9,500 US, which is, we're gonna call that 13,000 Canadian. Then we have wire transfer and EFT. So wire transfer, we received 10K on August 26, US dollars, that's 13.5K CAD. So that takes us to 66,500. And then we have about $3,500 Canadian of odds and ends payments from different sources. Now let's look at how much of this $70,000 is new revenue versus revenue we already have from past recurring clients. So under the agency, we signed on two new clients in August. Both of them were around $1,500 a month. So we added 3K of new revenue per month. And the, the nature of coaching is that we don't charge monthly retainers. So all coaching revenue will generally be new revenue. So this is new revenue. However, it was from prior YouTube videos. So now I wanna look at traffic sources, like where which traffic sources led to this revenue. So we have YouTube. And if we go to my channel right now, I'm getting about 30,000 views per month. Then we have referral partners who refer me business. And I have a second YouTube channel under the name of my agency, North Digital. And if you go to the North Digital account, this gets about 5,000 views per month. And these views are highly targeted just for people looking to solve digital marketing problems. Now, these three traffic sources account for essentially all of our revenue. Now, when we look at August, of the two new clients, one of them came in through YouTube and the other one came in through a referral partner. And if we look at the coaching revenue, all of the coaching revenue came in from my personal YouTube. So the takeaway here for me is like 95% of revenue in August came from work I have done over the past several years, reputation building, YouTube channel building, client results, etc. And this is where the idea of momentum comes from, where you have time, revenue, and you know, eventually you hit that exponential inflection point where most of this revenue is coming from work I've done in the past. And if you look at my personal life in August, I've been in three countries, a conference in the US and Canada. I've lived in five different apartments slash houses. It's been a huge travel adventure month. So to be able to earn 70,000 top line while having a month of adventure is a really powerful thing that this business model unlocks, building a digital marketing agency, running ads for clients, having a small team. And the reason why it unlocks that is because the heavy lifting is done by the algorithms of the ad platforms. And if this is something you're interested in building for yourself, subscribe to this channel, watch my other content. I'm gonna link a video right here, which talks about how I think you should get your first client if you want to build a digital marketing agency for yourself and really unlock whatever kind of life you want to unlock. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.